Well, good morning, everybody. No, it's not good morning. It's just morning. Well, I'm at Walmart. It's, uh, I don't know what day it is. Um, doing Plan B shopping. I have to get a turkey. Everybody, as soon as I said that I was going to do thanks, uh, whatever holiday, Christmas dinner, everybody said, no, seriously, just come to our house. I said, no, no, I'm gonna do my own turkey. So everybody said, Rush, you have to go buy one because it takes like for every so many pounds, days to thaw this sucker. So I'll tell you about why I'm doing Plan B. <laughs> so I have a list. Hopefully it includes, you know, I have to get stuff for stuffing, junk. And I'm kind of awake. <laughs> not awake, I'm not awake. It's like 8.30 in the friggin' morning. I don't wake up. I didn't go to sleep till 3.30. Everybody. Okay, so. Oh, oh, oh. I'm scared. Well, I'm going into Walmart. You know, the busy one. Not. It might actually be busy. You never know. They say stores are busy during Christmas, you know. Okay, well, okay. Well, I got one. Oh, God. If it looks like I've been in a windstorm, I have been. Oh, look. Blue Mountain Coffee. Somebody told me that was good. I just got a bunch of coffee. So, I have my list. I can't do crap like this this circle. Well, I'm hungry. I should have thought about eating something. Oh, I gotta go. I, I don't even know what I'm doing. Oh. Well, if you want to know what I'm having for Christmas dinner, well, plus a few extras, you'll get to see. Um, I bought two bags of stuffing. I just emulate what my grandmother did. And she'd use regular and cornbread. And in it I put um, hot pork sausage. It's a spicy spicy. I put onion. Oh, I didn't buy celery. Some frozen corn. I got crackers, Oreos, steaks for tonight. Uh, breakfast drink. Potatoes for mashed potatoes. I changed out the turkey. I said I want a butter ball instead, even though it costs more. And when I make mashed potatoes, I use butter and sour cream. Is that not decadent? Pumpkin pie. Some cookies in case the kids come tomorrow to bake. I had to have milk and then Hawaiian sweet rolls. And Wondra to make gravy. <sighs> the wind is awful. I need to... Um, Put this away and get some coffee. Bye. Be back. Well, I thought I'd explain why I'm doing Plan B for Christmas. Um, yesterday, I found out that um, my my daughter and son-in-law decided that they would do the Chris Christmas just the four of them. So this sucks. changed my plans, changed the great grandma's plans. <laughs> <laughs> and her dad's plans and basically I responded to this like oh you know those old ladies in the black and white movies that are like falling to the ground <laughs> screeching pulling their hair out ripping at their clothes why me God why me so <laughs> I had to regroup after that <laughs> so I just like forget it I'll just cook a turkey and invite a few strays over plus my son you know will come but I'm just not good at oh uh, surprises um, and I am a, a super sensitive person I mean if you, I mean I think we all know that by now oh I need to do some YouTube business <laughs> 
sorry, but the wind's blowing. When I mean blowing, it's like, I don't know, it's probably tapping 50, 60. And it's really dusty. Um, YouTube business. Some of you, because poor Natalie, the beauty diva, she's like, I thought you were subscribed to me. Some of my subscriptions just disappeared. I think I had to, I'm not sure. But all I know is everybody I watched was gone. I know that I um, had to resubscribe to Natalie, I think maybe Chris Ann, I think Mary Ellen. I don't know. I put an email into YouTube. They said that they don't know what happened. They never know what happens. And, um, you know, possibly maybe my account had gotten hacked. Um, I don't think so. So, uh, so yes, I have been subscribed to all of you, but, and I'm still, like, I know I'm missing a bunch of people. So, you know, as I go through my Rolodex in my head, I will figure it out. And two, Natalie, which is what I call you, glittering the sky. We're going to do something here. Some people pronounce your name Natalia. So if your name is pronounced Natalia, put one. And if it's announced Natalie, put two. And then that's the end of that. Because I do not want to call you by the wrong name. I love and adore you. So again, Natalia, put one. My name, you know, is is announced like one. Or Natalie, two. <laughs> I'm on the verge. Have, oh, have you guys ever seen the Italian movie? It's um, Women on the Verge. Uh, if not, watch it. It's subtitled, but it is so funny because there is a wife and a mistress involved, which by Italian standards, okay. But he, then he gets a girlfriend, and that's not okay. <laughs> well, I'm going to go for now. I'll, I'm going to be so, and I'll check in. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, I mean, poor Danny even called and said, do you want me to come back? It's like, no, I'm okay. <laughs> um, I, you know, we can only hope I can get the turkey cooked. Um, in my many years, since I'm as old as dirt, um, I think I've actually cooked um, three turkeys alone. Two. Because I think the because my ex-husband used to cook them. And then I had a boyfriend of you know, many, many, many years. And um, he died. Um, he was a physicist. Um, I, I like really smart men. But um, everybody else on the earth seems to know. But I was doing a uh, reading butterball. Uh, they have a website and they also have a hotline so you never know but so far I've cooked a turkey upside down uh, the a turkey with all the junk stuck still in it um, so that's the two times cuz I kind of cooked a turkey one other time but like I said, my ex-husband was more in charge of it. I don't really cook that good, you guys. And so I, you know, between family and like, um, you know, I love boyfriends that know how to cook. I love it. You know, like Danny's going, I'm on standby if you need help. I'm on standby. It's like, okay, I'm a well-educated woman. I think I can pull this one off. I have no faith in myself. None. Absolutely none. <laughs> well, I've been sewing. I got my daughter's pants almost made. And I matched up the pattern. Perfect. 
I'm going to make some pig in the blankets. And I got dishwasher basically full so I can run it in a little bit. Oh, and like, I may not have said because of my um, exasperated behavior why Christmas kind of got canceled. It's because they've decided this may be the last one that they celebrate as a family due to the separation and so on and so forth. So, um, that's the only reason why I came to my senses. Well, and I'm watching a movie. It's called Heaven is Real. Um, don't know anything. Can't report back on it. No. So, I'll finish up my daughter's. Then I'll cut out the two kids because basically from their measurements they are basically the same size. One pair of pants needs to be cut longer, one shorter, which I'll do, you know, I'll trim before I hem them. So that's what's going on. Oh, and today is Sunday. I figured out what day it was. Oh, me and my, you know, I haven't even brushed my hair yet. Um, and I, oh, what else have I not done? Uh, I don't know. Apparently, it's no, oh, vitamins. I was going to take vitamins. I need to get a glass of water. That's one thing I'm really not doing well on is water. Not. And, um, I'll get back to you. Well, they're almost done. Uh, I've got some food. Look at this. I've got everything. I've got a keyboard. <laughs> Goes underneath the couch. Um, I'm gonna eat. You know, um, these were hot dogs. I wouldn't like them, but they're the Johnsonville cheddar with jalapenos. Oh, they're so good. I have water. Oh, darn. I have to get a vitamin packet. And I'm going to watch a little of the movie, Thread Through the Elastic. And I may have come to a horrible thing. I may not have enough elastic. So I may have to go out and go shopping. I don't want to. I don't want to. Well, I'm going to eat and gather my senses for a minute. <sighs> yes, another pair done. Shit. Almost done. Um, I think the pattern's pretty close. It's like a little teeny tilted. Oh well. Um, I have to put a bow. Yeah. You know, nice ribbon. And sew it on because my daughter doesn't like drawstrings. So that's uh four down and only two to go. Oh god, I don't even think I can see out of my glasses anymore. Well lunch was good. I got you know the elastic sewed in and um but I don't know if I have enough. Cause I only need two more pairs. Only two more pairs. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. So, I think this is probably it for me. But, oh, and the uh, ones I bought with little spaceships for Julie, she loved them. Loved them. Loved them. And, um, I made Danny's, which maybe I can get a picture of them wearing them. I doubt it. Um, Let's see, what else? I don't know, I don't know. Um, I just don't do well waking up early. I'm not an early riser. I never, I never have been in all my life. I mean, I have gotten up many a morning, but I'm not naturally an, an early bird. I'm just not. I mean, you know. Everybody's always had to drag me out of bed, even when I was little. It's like, 
I don't want to go to school. It's too early. And then I'd go, oh, school. I want to go to school. Because I actually, I'm like, my granddaughter is just like me. She loves to go to school. It's, it's like, we're weird. We're just weird people. Um, but I think that's it for me. Um, might eat another hot dog. The movie I'm watching, it's like, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't, I mean, I'm still watching it, so that's something. I haven't just, you know, normally if I don't like it, I just go, okay, never mind. Because I have another one I want to watch. It's got um, Michael Douglas and Diane Keaton in it. I'm going to be so, but, you know, like I'm on the downhill slope of everything. Oh, crap. Except now I have to wrap everything up. <laughs> oh, oh, I hate wrapping. I wonder if I can get my grandchildren to wrap because they're coming to, maybe tomorrow. And they have still a bunch of wrapping. I could have them throw some paper on their parents. Maybe. Oh, well. <sighs> you know, I, I just... It is what it is. It is what it is. Well... I probably won't see you again. <laughs> I keep saying that, but you never know. <laughs> you never know. Um, I love you guys a bunch. Um, but just in case, happy holidays again. No, seriously, happy holidays. And everybody be safe, be careful, and be happy. Okay? Bye-bye, guys.